want somebody good, and I mean very good, to plant that gun. James Caan made a mark as mobster Sonny Corleone in The Godfather, arguably the most famous of his more than 100 roles. Hey, it's my sister's wedding. Before The Godfather turned him into a 70s superstar, we first met Khan in 1961, making his television debut in an episode of Naked City. Hey, we said we were getting you a doctor, didn't we? Uh, what do you want to carry on like that for? A few years later, he was back on the big screen, terrorizing Olivia de Havilland in Lady in a Cage. Right now, I am all... In 1967, Khan would appear with John Wayne in El Dorado, and in 71, he played dying football star Brian Piccolo in the celebrated TV movie Brian's Song. This thing I got's bad, I know that. It was based on the true story of the friendship between Piccolo and his Chicago Bears teammate Gail Sayers. I'll see you tomorrow. Khan received an Emmy nomination for that performance. As the 70s rolled on, Khan was front and center. There was Cinderella Liberty, Freebie and the Bean, The Godfather Part Two. The saps because they risked their lives for strangers. He had two hits in 75, Funny Lady with Barbara Streisand and the futuristic Rollerball. A year later, he was back to comedy, having a moment in the Mel Brooks classic, Silent Movie. He was also part of director Richard Attenborough's war drama, A Bridge Too Far. And he starred opposite Marsha Mason in Neil Simon's Chapter 2. Hello. Hello. Khan seemed to know how to pick memorable movies. With Kathy Bates in 1990's Misery, he played an author terrorized by his biggest fan. You just better start showing me a little more appreciation around here, Mr. Man. A year later, he was Bette Midler's leading man, both of them entertaining our troops during tough times in the war drama for the boys. Sing him a song, honey. He's earned it. And in a Christmas comedy classic, Khan even starred as dad to Will Ferrell's Elf. I love you. Okay, go to sleep now. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.